Hello everybody, my name is Will or Mr. Williamo. Welcome back to another Minecraft video. It sounds, it still feels so weird for me to just say that and I'm actually doing a video, I'm not doing it as a meme. Uh, <laughs> but in the last episode, we went mining for some diamonds and we actually found loads of emeralds uh, that aren't in this chest, they're still down there. Right, we're gonna have to, <laughs> we're gonna have to get those and bring them up here. But you might notice I'm in a different place to where we ended off the last episode. We ended off the last episode just at the top of our little base, which I think is there. No, it's not there. What's that black sheep do? Uh, it's where Pink Sheep is. It was somewhere over in that direction. I think he's over there in that hole there. Uh, but I have gone and created myself a nice little home within the mountain with the lava waterfall, which I think looks okay at the moment. Obviously this is just like a starting point and we can expand upon it and make it pretty epic. If you remember the crazy cave from Crazy Craft, like we've made another cave, I think that's just my kind of thing. And all you people in the comments saying, oh Will, you, like your videos were my childhood and all that kind of stuff, like that's absolutely amazing and that's one of the reasons why I, I just loved making these videos back in the day. And if you're still here, like coming back, reminiscing with the revolution that is Minecraft coming back, then I thank you. I cheers to you, and if you could like my video, that'd be great. Oh yeah, like I also built uh, a huge cobblestone tower on top of there, in case I ever got lost. Because from this angle, like if I was over that way, I'd be able to see the lava waterfall and my cave, like kind of well, I think. But from the other way, I'd have no idea, and I'm probably gonna get lost anyway. Uh, but this is the, the bedroom so far. It's pretty bland, it's pretty bland. We've just got stone walls, Couple of furnaces, got some jack-o'-lanterns to light the place up and they're just, if if you don't have jack-o'-lanterns at the front of a Minecraft house, what are you even doing? What are you even doing? I placed some water here because my idea was that I'd be able to just like fall all the way down. But then what happened was, if we go down to this little bit here, what happened was it kind of reacted with the lava and made loads of cobblestone and then the lava kind of overspilled a lot so <laughs> that didn't go to plan. But we also have lava on this side as well. I collected some up in a bucket. So it wasn't just lava on one side. Uh, it looks a little bit more symmetrical. I tried to make the little balcony bit out of wood and it kept setting on fire because it's so close to the lava. And I kind of put some fences down here as like stilts. Works on this side, but on that side it's too close to the lava. So we've got a one-sided stilt thing, uh, but it kind of works. And we can still jump from the top down into the river. I've tested it and it, it works, trust me. Just about, just about. And then I thought, you know what? We could uh, come down here in this little bit and what will be really cool, I've not built it yet, but behind the waterfall, in video games, there's, there always has to be something cool behind a waterfall. And that looks insane because you can just see straight through the waterfall with the shaders on. Uh, but if we have some kind of secret thing underneath us, obviously we'll have to build it out into the mountain, uh, but we can do that another episode and stuff. The only reason why I've not really done this in an episode is because it takes me so long to come up with like ideas of things that might work uh, that I just don't commentate and it would be a really boring video. And I didn't even bother recording for like a montage. But if we could do something in here, maybe like an enchanting room, uh, we could even have a farm in here or grow in some, I got some melon seeds and pumpkin seeds, do that in here, or whatever else you guys think I could do. Let me know in the comments down below. And obviously, I read all of them and I can include you in the next episode or the, whenever we do the next one and we can build some stuff in here. Uh, but if we go through the water, I need to be careful not to fall down that bit, although I can just swim up. Uh, and another problem that I found from having my house up here is that it's very snowy and rainy a lot of the time, which <laughs> get a little bit annoying after a while. Uh, so I don't know if I'm gonna have to rethink that one a little bit. But if we go up here onto the walkway, I was thinking that we could possibly make ourselves a pen for uh, Thor. Smite me down, Thor. A pen for for pink sheep up here. So our challenge for this episode, I think, will be to get pink sheep up. And what's going on over there? Did I get hit by lightning? It's on fire. I think it is. Ah, uh, forest fire started. Well then, and then over here, I was thinking we could possibly like build this like all the way around the mountain, maybe, or just a little bit, if we've got our secret inside bit, would look pretty pretty tasty. Uh, but look at that. And then here, I was like, maybe we could grow some wheat, uh, but all the water's turned to ice. So again, I don't know if that's gonna work either. And also, I'm pretty sure to 
Actually, no, I don't think you need it to turn into grass. If I just had a hoe, I could put it on there, and I think that would work. I think we could grow some wheat for our, our vegan lifestyle. Gotta get that bread. Uh, but that's a little short tour of my, my beautiful cave house. Mountain house, I uh, don't know what we should call it, but let's go to sleep. There we go, look at that. Waking up to this beautiful view. That is why I bought this house for a quarter of a million pounds. Look at that. It's just beautiful. Um, we need to colour our bed as well, we need some dye for that. Uh, let's go down, I think. Yeah, let's go down. Let's go down. Let's go down and do it. So if we die now, we should respawn back here. And if I go this way, I can just go all the way down through the waterfall, but nope. It's like, there we go. Look at all of this, like all this bottom bit turned into cobblestone. But, but I like it. I like it a lot. It's a good foundation for a nice little base. And I'm by no means like a sick builder or someone who's good at ideas of interior design and stuff in Minecraft, but we'll get there eventually and it'll look all right. <laughs> I hope. If we get a, a little side-on view from down here. Oh baby, there it is. Looks sick. And then I could put my satellite up there on top so I can get some TV channels in there. I watch all my sports. Brilliant. Right, now to get all my stuff from the chest that was this way, we could probably bring a llama up as well. Uh, but the only annoying thing about this, at the moment, I might be able to figure something out. Uh, look at that, it looks so sick. Oh my god, right. There's, there's the thumbnail right there. Boom. Boom. Maybe. <laughs> but to get up, I have to swim up the waterfall. Like there, if I could teleport myself up, I don't know if you can even do that in survival. Somehow, with a command block or something, I, I could do that. Uh, but who knows? Pink sheep, you're coming with me all the way to the top. I've got a lead, so I think you can do that on sheep. Uh, but let's just go down and grab our items from the chest. I've kind of figured out this cave system now as well. I got so lost in the last episode, I cut it all out. I've kind of figured it out. We didn't explore it fully, uh, but most of it. So we got four diamonds from that trip, five emeralds, some iron horse armor. We've got a music disc, so you need to make a jukebox up there. Name tag, saddle, compass, we could probably do keeping. Right, do we have enough space for everything? Just, we don't really need to bring the stone swords and the mm, gunpowder. Could be all right, we could swap that for dirt. And is there anything left in here? Gold, iron, and we can just leave that stuff there. So this was, you were a great home for one night. Two nights, maybe. But now, we must move on. Thank you. But I'm taking Pink Sheep with me. Alright? Hopefully Pink Sheep can swim up the waterfall. Because if he can't... That's gonna suck. Come on, dude. Yes! He can finally make it up! He's free! Pink Sheep is free! Like Dobby from Harry Potter. Right, does he follow me now? Yes! You can come with me, Pink Sheep. Uh, I don't know... I don't have a name. Actually, I think I called him Gerald. I think. I name things in Minecraft far too much, so I think he's called Gerald. Or Pink Sheep, for short. That's not how short names work, Will. Uh, <laughs> right, come on, Gerald. Gerald. Did I lose him? Did the lead... If I Did I run off and the lead just broke? There it is. Gerald, you are coming with me, and there's nothing you can do about it. Apart from break the lead again. But, right, I'm gonna go into third person mode, I think, because that means that he follows. Yep, come on, there we go. Means if the lead breaks off, I can just see. Right, oh, I'd be sick if I could make some kind of aquarium up in there. That could be something we could do. There's some fish down here that we can steal for our aquarium. And uh, there's a spooky Minecraft noise. There it is, right, you see, this, this is where it can go Possibly terribly wrong. <laughs> oh no. I can just see this happening. He's just gonna fall in the lava, isn't he? Right, do I have anything that I can use to, to make it a little bit safer? Some andesite. The wood's just gonna burn. Orange terracotta. Does that burn? Right, come this way. Uh, and not that way. Okay. I think he should be good. No, 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 no. That's lava. This way. 
Right. Up this way. Can he even swim up? He'd like to think he can. Come on! Come! There's no use barring at me. Just come up. No! I knew it was going to happen. <laughs> I should have just climbed up. Uh, ah, no. I mean, this looks pretty cool, but... Pink sheep. We need, we need to put a, a memorial place down. There's flowers there already. We can make a gravestone for pink sheep. <sighs> it was worth a try. Well, uh, does that mean his lead's gone? I think it does. I was going to say, we could try and get black sheep instead. He could be the new pink sheep. There he is. Uh, except I think we need to make a new lead. I can't remember how you make leads. Well, we'll go up anyway and we can come back down. Uh, and try and get try and get him to follow us. We might have to uh, yeah, okay. If we do this and then come down over this way, he can just walk across and then up. Yeah, sounds like sounds like a plan. That's probably not gonna work. But we'll try it anyway. See this is the elevator to get up to my amazing mountain house. Nah, oh, wrong button. <laughs> wrong button. Right, let's just put my stuff in my house at the moment so we don't die and lose all our emeralds and diamonds that we worked hard for in the last episode. Uh, we go. It looks cool with shaders in third person. I don't know what it is. Do you guys like watching it like this? Or is it just better like this? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Right, diamonds, emeralds. We've got two horse armors now and two saddles so we can kit up two horses. Like, no problem. Alright, I'm just kind of putting stuff in periodically. I don't know. Um, we could actually try and build ourselves. Lapis, you can go there. Let's get uh, a hoe and see if our farm could work. Don't know if it's gonna, but we can see. Alright, there's a hoe. Loyalty 5,000. Right, normal wheat seeds because for melon and pumpkins, I'm pretty sure you need... Uh, extra space, I think. I think, right, you could go in there and you can go in there too. That's a lot of... Oh, we Do we have string yet? We do, we can we can make a bow. Decent. Uh, let's make a bow now then. Let's just do it. Just gonna do it. Still gonna send it. Right, can I do it this way? Oh, that's so much easier, man. So much easier. New recipe books as well. Right, gunpowder you can go in there, and string you can go in there, and we've got arrows, leather, zombies, shizney, and bones. Oh, we need to get a dog. If you see dog, we can bring some dogs up to our mountain home. It's a very dangerous home for mobs. It really is. I didn't think that was through. But if we get them up here, that'd be like total legitness. And snow just starts forming up here because we're so high up. Okay, if I break this, it'll just turn to water. It does, good. Right, let's try it. See how long it takes for it to turn to, to ice again. Or if it would turn to ice at all. We may have made ourselves the highest farm in the world. Guinness World Records. Come at me. A seedy place. Yes, that's this. Right, well hopefully they'll grow. Um, if it, if it, ah, it turns to ice. No. Is there a way we can warm it up? <laughs> if we put torches down, does that warm it up? Or lava underneath it. <laughs> if we put lava underneath, that would warm it up, right? You'd like to think. I need to make a, a bigger walkway around because if we're walking over wheat, walking over our farm, that ain't gonna stick with me. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Right, um, I'm gonna figure out how to make a lead and we can try and get black sheep. Okay? We'll try. It'll be a quest. A quest for the ages. And with this bit, I tried to keep it like nice and open. At first, I put loads of glass down. I got loads of sand and smelted it, or like wood or whatever. But I just like it being open. What's the point in having a mount? Uh, what's the point in having a mountain? What's the point in <laughs> having a house inside of the mountain if you can't look at the view? Black sheep, where are you? There he is. Good boy. Right, the time has come for you to come with me. Maybe this way. Do you, do you have a lead? He does. Right. Come with me, black sheep. This way. Don't die there. Come on. 
Come on. Right, we oh, there's a grey sheep as well. We could get a llama up, maybe. But, I mean, we have to get black sheep up first. The lead broke. That took me, like, ages to find slime to good, do this. Come. Come off. We go around the side this time, okay. Like your brother pink sheep, he didn't listen to me. Right, the, the lead breaks so easily. No. Come. But the lead better not break when, like, we're <laughs> over the lava. Because that would suck. Okay, we need to go over this bit. Alright. You coming? You can see the remains of pink sheep somewhere over there. So, don't follow him. Follow me. I know what I'm doing. I'm a slime man in a suit. Up this way. Good. See? I think black sheep shoots a little bit smarter than pink sheep. But we'll see. We've not, we've not got to the hardest bit yet. Come on. Up you come. Maybe he's not that smart. He hurt himself. What did you do? What did you do to hurt yourself then? Right, come. Down this way. Okay. And now, do I have some dirt that can, uh, that can go there? And... No, not there. Third person's hard. Not there either. Um, and a sight, right. First person. Okay. Right. A little bit safer for you. Come on. He's coming. Oh boy. No, 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 no. Don't turn around. What are you doing turning around for? This way. This way. This way. He's up. Okay. And now. <laughs> you, you made it up so far, Black Sheep. Good boy. Good boy. All good. I don't know yet. I uh, don't know yet. Anyway. Right. Up we go. Okay. Up this way. <gasps> Mate. Mate. Up we go. Is he in? No, no, no! Come on. In the water. Come up. <gasps> He's up. He's up. Yes, now in this one. Yes. Oh my god. He's up. He's coming. We could have done this, boys and girls. We could have achieved greatness. Just one little bit. He's still dangling. <laughs> we need to go higher. Come on. Get out of the way. Up. <gasps> the lead broke. Did the lead break? I think it did. Where's the lead? Is that the lead? It is. Oh man. We so nearly achieved greatness. Ah. And I'm on fire. Did I get the lead though? I did. Good. Good. Okay, Black Sheep's still up there I think. This is intense gameplay. But if I pull it off, it'll be an absolutely epic game of moment. Ah, oh, that is on fire! No! <laughs> no! My bridge is on fire! Oh no! Quick! Quick! Black sheep! Why have you done this? I can't believe you just done this. How is it on fire? I can't put it out! No, I'm falling to my- <laughs> Oh my god, black sheep. It is all your fault. Get it from a specific angle. Not a pacific angle. Specific. I can't put it out. Get out. No, it's spreading too fast. Ah. This is why I should have made it out of stone. Ah. And black sheep is nowhere to be seen. I'm going to die again. It's going to be ruined. All ruined. Alright. We're good. We're not good. Let's just break this block and it can't spread anymore. It's still spreading. My god. It was a terrible idea to bring black sheep up. It's spreading over here now. Okay, I think we're good. Something's still on fire. Probably me. Alright, well my walkway is completely destroyed. And where is black sheep? 
can't have... Did he swim up? Nope. He probably died. I mean, he got what he d deserved, really. Why did I try and uh, bring up an animal to the hardest place in basically the entire world? And now half of my stuff's probably fallen in the lava itself. But maybe not. You never know. Still got some stuff. What have we got? Yeah, we lost quite a lot of stuff. <laughs> not too bad, though. Why is that there? Oh, because I broke it from all the way up there. The black sheep's just disappeared as well. The curse of black sheep. All right. What, is, what even is in here? Oh, there's a cave underneath that leads maybe somewhere. Wait, that goes very deep. I just gotta, just gotta explore. I mean, you just have to. I also have uh, one and a half hearts. So if I get shot by this guy, oh, I lost my shield. That's a creeper. Brilliant. Well, it's nice to know there's a cave right underneath my house. But black sheep and pink. Well, pink sheep was. Pink sheep had good intentions. But black sheep. Black sheep just sucks. <laughs> black sheep just sucks, man. Alright. Well, I showed you my house. And hopefully we can get animals up there next time. The llamas might be more useful. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much for watching, boys and girls. I'm going to get my stuff back uh, and where we were last time. I think in the next episode, I'm going to try and go on like a treasure hunt in the water, possibly. Because if you find dolphins and feed them fish, then they can take you to hidden treasure. So we need to build a boat and we can go and do that. But thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, smash the like button down below. My name is Will, I'm Mr. Williamo. I'll see you on my next one. Adios.